Hello guys, it's Johnny time and welcome to another DeFi tutorial. If you cannot find your tokens in your Trezor wallet or they just disappeared the coins, this is the tutorial of how to restore and recover disappeared tokens from the Trezor suit, the Trezor hardware called wallet. And if you want to be exposed to more high quality tutorials, make sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell notification button. Now without further ado, let's get started. So let's say you have USDT in your wallet, in your Trezor suit wallet, maybe someone sent you USDT or any other tokens, it could be Uni, Sushi tokens, whatever, doesn't matter, Maker, doesn't matter. And you cannot find them here on the Trezor suit. So the first step in order to restore them and to find them is to connect the Trezor wallet to the computer and then of course open the Trezor suit application. Now, you want to get into Ethereum Okay, so you're gonna click here Ethereum and then you're gonna click tokens because these are tokens inside the Ethereum blockchain. These are ERC20 tokens. Now you need to click here add token and you will have to paste the ERC20 token address. Now the next question is how do you find the USDT token address? By the way guys, if you still don't have a hardware called wallet, don't wait. This is just a small investment that will make all your crypto much safer and always make sure that you buy this kind of Trezor device from the official Trezor website and not from some kind of sellers suspicious sellers or even not eBay and Amazon because someone may alter with your hardware with your firmware and if you want to help me out just check the description I have a link to the official Trezor website and you will pay the same price but I will get a small commission it's called affiliate link and it will help me to scale up my channel and keep going and creating more free educational content so the easiest way to find the token address that you want to add is easier basically going to etherscan.io this is the blockchain explorer of ethereum and then here on the search bar you can try searching the token name for example if you cannot find your usdt token you're just gonna search usdt all right and then you can see here tokens erc20 and click on the first result tether usd usdt token now, this is the page that represents the USDT token. It's a smart contract that represents an ERC20 token, but this is just too much technical terms. You don't have to know that. Now, you just need to know that you need to go here to the profile summary, to the contract attribute, and copy the contract address by clicking here, this kind of small icon, copy address. You can see that it's copied, and now we can easily go back to your Trezor suit application and paste the address that you just copied. So I'm gonna paste it over here, click add token, and congratulations, you were able to add the token to your Trezor wallet, to your Trezor suit wallet, and now it's presentable and you can see it here under the accounts of Ethereum. You can see that now I don't have any USDT in this wallet, that's why I chose zero. But if you have USDT tokens on your wallet, it will show the number. Unfortunately, Trezor does not show the tokens here in the main dashboard. And if you want to see the tokens, you have to get into Ethereum and then get into tokens. That's it. Super simple step, super easy. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for another educational content. Thank you so much for watching my videos and I will see you in the next tutorials. Bye bye.